How is it going lads and welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, what I've got for you is some elite squad battles. But before we do that, I'm actually going to open up these 50k packs on my Xbox account. Haven't actually been on this account in ages. So let's see what the pack look is like. Obviously on the PlayStation account, we've got three walkouts in one pack. And we got like, I think four walkouts in a row from these 50k packs. And we start with an onboard. Great start. Just so excited to continue. But we also have elite squad battle rewards, which will be opening... Just after this segment, really. Um, probably Elite 2 or Elite 1. I can't remember which one it was. I think it's Elite 1, but it might be Elite 2. But we are going to open up a couple of these 50k packs. I just want to see what my look is like. I've not opened packs on this account in so long. We get a walkout. There you go. There you go. What's it going to be? It's going to be 86 plus regular play. It's going to be Spanish. Center back, Ramos. Oh, it's Azpilicueta. Damn it. Uh... The amount of times I've really thought I've got Ramos and it's just not been Ramos is disappointing. But uh, how much does Aspi sell for? 25k is not too bad, to be fair. We'll take it. So 25k player. Not not bad. I was, <laughs> yeah, I, I've had PK and Aspilicueta way too many times now to care. I just wish that like I packed a Ramos at least one of those times. That'd be great. Uh, and we don't really care about this. I'll just discard the rest. I don't need players in the club. Um, let's go ahead and open up. These last couple. I also have my uh, pre-order packs on this account as well. Back-to-back, -back, no back-to-back -back walkout. So the look hasn't been as good on this account as it has been on my PlayStation account already. Spanish, right winger. Who's this? Lucas Vasquez, 83 rated. Pretty meh. I don't think he really sells for anything. I don't think a lot of players are selling right now. I think the only players really that are selling are the really big players. And then maybe like a couple of these players. Maybe a Wendell might be selling for like 1,015. Nope, not even that. So uh, we'll go ahead and discard that. Um, and we'll open up the last. I think we've got one. Yeah, we've got one more left. I've got enough to open a prime gold players back as well. I only put on like 30 pounds a few points because I didn't really see the point. As we get a non walkout in the next one, this isn't even a board, is it? Not even a board. My No wonder I play on PlayStation. My Xbox account is absolutely rigged. The pack look is absolutely terrible in this account. So go ahead and discard that. And we'll also open my uh, two 15k packs after this too. So can we get anything from a prime gold players back here? Anything at all? Walkout. Interesting. We got a walkout out of a Prime Players pack. Oh, we got a UCL player. We got a UCL live item. Brazilian. Left back. Is that Alex Tellez? Oh, my God. No way. As I was complaining. As I was complaining. How much is Alex Tellez going for? Oh, my God. 130k. Holy crap. Wow. That is absolutely insane. Let's go. Oh, my word. Yo, that is nuts. <laughs> No way. That's the first one I've packed so far. I take it back, EA. Thank you for the pack look. Wow, and an inform in the same pack. Oh, my word. Inform Jao Mario. That's two walkouts as well. So, Alex Salas is about 130k. We'll go ahead and list this card up for about 128, maybe. Uh, 126, I think is fair. He'll sell for that. Uh, Jao Mario is about 19k, so I'll list him up for 18. Hopefully get a quick sell from that. The rest of them don't really sell, so we'll go ahead and discard that. What a what a couple of packs. That is incredible. That is absolutely incredible. Right. We have our two 15k packs for pre-order in the game as well. We'll quickly open these. Not expecting anything from either of these. But that that is honestly insane. I'm, that's the best, I think, best packs I've actually had on my Xbox so far that were tradable. I've had a canteen on tradable packs. But um, that, is, that is actually really, really sick. So I'll go ahead and take that. I don't really need anything from these. Maybe there's a couple of expensive consumables. Maybe that will sell... Uh, apart from that, we don't need anything from there because I really don't play much on this account anymore. Um, I do Fatal and that's literally it. So, you know, not entirely sure what I'm going to do on this account. Maybe I do some SBCs and stuff on this account for videos. But apart from that, I really don't mu do much on it. So uh, we get Alex Pato there. Again, someone that doesn't really sell. Maybe we'll have some decent consumables in this pack. We'll, like, we'll put it down there and then go check. Eh, maybe they'll sell. Apart from that, I can't see anything else that sells. So, let's go ahead and open the Elite Squad Battle Awards. What insane pack look we've had so far. All right, now we have got Johnny's Elite Squad Battle Awards. Let's see actually which ones we have. It's Elite 1. There you go. We've got Elite 1 Squad Battle Awards. Not too shabby right there. Uh, a lot of grinding needs to be done for Elite 1 Squad Battle Awards. I don't think people realize we also get the Poland kit. Damn, that's actually a really nice kit. That actually looks really nice. I'm a big fan of that kit. So, go ahead and store that. A lot of grinding goes into these videos, like, for, for, for people to, to allow me to open their packs. So I'm very, very grateful, of course, to Johnny and other people who let me open their packs. I'm, I'm genuinely very grateful. So a massive thank you to them. Let's go ahead and open these rewards, and hopefully we can give back with pack look like we've just had on my account. Because, um, 
you know, hopefully, hopefully we can get something close to that because that was just insane in my opinion. That's the first UCL live item or UCL road to the final that I have packed. But uh, by the looks of this 15k pack, it's not going to start off well. But then again, my 15k packs weren't great, so I'm holding out hope. I am. Uh, let's go ahead and open that. But I think that this year they've updated Elite One Squad Battle Rewards to have two rare Mega Packs, which in my opinion makes a huge difference to what you can get. Mega Packs are decent, but they don't seem to give out that many good like 85, 86, 87 plus rated players. Whereas I feel like the rare Mega Packs have a lot more look and just have you know, a better ability to get those kind of players. So, I mean, that's just my opinion. Let me know down below which packs you prefer. Actually, let me know which is your favorite pack. If I was to go off my favorite pack, I probably would say the. you know, I think the rare mega pack would have to be my favorite because if we look at the pack probabilities here, an 87 plus player in a mega pack is 4.1%. And I think with a rare mega pack, it's like 5.8% or something. So that's maybe like one in 20 packs, but it doesn't have to be you open 19 packs to get one. It can be literally the first one you open and then 20 after that, nothing. If that is just how odds work. I mean, obviously odds don't like odds are based on look, so they can work differently. And then a 50k pack has a 5.2% of getting 88 plus, which I think is pretty nuts. Um, and 95% of getting an 82 plus player. Uh, a UCL wrote to the final is actually 3.4%, whereas a 1.7% chance of getting a 45k pack. So that's actually pretty lucky. Anyway, enough speaking. Let's go ahead and open these packs and see if we can get anything good in any of these rare megas. It's going to be a non walkout in the first one. Is it going to be a board? No, it's not going to be a board up. Wow. That's disappointing. Not a great start with these rare mega packs. Ouchie. That is, uh, that, that isn't great. That isn't that isn't very good at all, actually. I'm, I'm not happy with that. I am not happy with that at all. But uh, let's see. Let's hold out hope. I do want to show you guys some of the players Johnny's actually got untradeable. Johnny has a fantastic untradeable club. So I have to say, like, hats off to Johnny for his untradeable club. It's actually pretty nuts. Okay. Second rare mega pack. Come on, EA. Hook a brother up. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Yes, we've got to walk out. Let's go. Come on. Come on. What's it going to be? Come on. Italian. Center back, Chiellini, Chiellini, Benucci, 86 to 8 Benucci. It's a walkout, so we cannot complain. We've had two walkouts. Well, technically four walkouts in this video, but two 86 pluses, and then obviously the UCL live item and the, uh, the 84 plus in form. So pretty decent, if you ask me. That's actually a really solid pull as well. I don't know how much Benucci currently sells for. Um, how much is Benucci? Oh, wow, look at that pack. An 84 in there as well. An 84 there too. Oh, 17,000 coins is not bad. Ilira Mendy, I think, has a value of, yeah, about 5-ish, 4-ish K. Uh, Pedro, I don't know if he's selling, but we'll send him to the transfer list anyway. That is a really, really good pack. You got a center forward to cam card as well. They sell. I think they're literally discard right now. Not discard. Uh, max price, sorry. Uh, yeah, they're around 5,000 coins, which is absolutely nuts. And Anderson Taliska there. And a Shakiri. You know what? That's actually been a pretty solid pack. That's actually been pretty decent. Uh, Leicester City kit there as well. Uh, you know, shout out to Leicester. Shout out to Leicester there. Actually, I'm from Leicester, if you guys didn't know, which is uh, which is interesting. So, go ahead and discard that. I want to quickly show you guys Johnny's club as well to end it. I think it's been a really, really good video. I don't know about you guys, but I think it's been really solid. Compared to what I usually get in these kind of reward videos, it's been pretty decent. So, uh, let me quickly show you guys Johnny's club. So, Johnny's club starts out with a Suarez. An untradeable Suarez, which I'm actually shocked at how... Uh, how poor of a record he's got with Suarez. I loved Suarez personally. He scored a lot of goals for me. I really enjoyed him. He, of course, has prime icon Ferdinand, which he got from the Ferdinand SBC. Play of the month of Bamiyang. And untradeable Sane as well, which is incredible. That's nuts if you ask me. Uh, he did SBC Rooney, which is really cool too. Uh, I just think that he has a really solid club. Like, I know a lot of people have a lot of, like, 86, 87, 88. But to have, like, a Suarez and a Sane, two players that have, a, I think they have a value of about 400 to 500,000 coins. And in my opinion, are used so much. I think that's super lucky. And it's definitely better than... Well, it's not better than my club, actually. Wow, I've, I've gained 200k from those 50ks and 45k pack. Uh, if I was to go into my club, though, they, they're, of course, the fatal players. Let me quickly uh, change the search parameters to uh, low to high here and go... Oh, God, we need to go gold as well. I'm having a bit of a mare here. If I was to go into my club, I think I've got a really, really solid club in terms of untradeables. It's, in my opinion, like very, very good. Let me know what you think down below. We've got an untradeable UCL Hummels. We've got Kante, Casemiro, and Thiago Silva. We've got uh, the other Thiago, Thiago Alicante. We've got uh, SBC, Juan Fran, Boateng, Kula Bali, Alisson, Lucas... Matic, Alexandro as well, which is fantastic. Uh, Firmino, who is also fant 
fantastic. Uh, Mandzukic scream card there and Mandzukic UCL card. Uh, Paulinho in form on Nautovic. Pretty solid and tradable club if you ask me. So I'm going to end this video here. If you guys did enjoy, smash the like down below. Subscribe to my channel if you guys are new around here. Thank you all for the epic support recently. Very grateful for all the support. You guys are absolutely smashing it. And I'll see you lads later.